Hi friends, welcome to the part 2 of the discussion on civil services prelims paper. In this discussion, I will be basically explaining you why UPSC has given these questions this year, what was the motivation behind and how UPSC frames questions from the current issues. Here I will be also explaining you how I was able to predict more than 70 to 75 questions in this year's prelims paper. Let us continue with question number 27. Guys, here you see the magic guys. Okay, just see this magic. This was a question in the UPSC. Consider the following countries. Okay, Azerbaijan, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan. Which of the above has borders with Afghanistan? Guys, just you see the PPP. Just you see my prelims power play question. Prelims power play question I have given. You see, Afghanistan shares border with which of the following Central Asian countries? Just imagine guys, you see even the options are same, even the options are same. Guys, that is why I say guys, if you read the right material, if you solve the right questions throughout the year, no one can stop you from cracking the prelims exam guys. And I tell you with my experience guys, guys I have done this six times guys and I will help you do it okay in your maiden attempt guys. If you continue to read this daily prelims notes and solve the PPP and solve regular practice. If you do regular practice of the Lakshya test, guys, no one can stop you from cracking the prelims exam. You see here how I was able to predict the same question, guys. You see, predict the exactly same question because let me now tell you why this question was asked because Central Asian countries, Central Asian countries along with India and China they are helping the Afghanistan solve the humanitarian crisis because Afghanistan is facing through humanitarian crisis guys and that is why I had asked this question because if you see generally question from the IR section okay they involve map okay they involve map so I thought that okay what can kind of questions can come from Afghanistan then I saw the map of Afghanistan and I saw that okay bordering countries with Central Asian countries can come you see exactly this question I had given and then UPSC has directly taken this question directly you see this you see don't you think this is amazing guys how can someone even predict the same options guys exactly word to word question this is amazing or not guys if you it is if you think it is amazing tell from the heart and you tell in the comment box yes it is amazing sir and you say it is really great guys okay and i'm thankful to the god to give me this uh, understanding of this pattern and it is my duty to share with you guys let us see now next question guys 20 question with reference to india consider the following statements guys monazite is a source of rare earth monazite contains thorium monazite occurs natural uh, naturally in the entire coast of india and in india government only can process the monazite guys now let me tell you exactly this question i have given in the test exactly this question you see i have given in the test guys you can see here rare earth metal flt 1043 F flt 1043 flt 3 okay i have given this rare earth metal and one more question i gave you see this question number 55 Test number 1007 NCRT Geography India has deposit of monazite Okay, monazite deposits are found in the beach sand and Kerala coast contains the largest deposit of monazite This is exactly the same question Guys, now let me explain you why this question I have given in uh, FLT full length test also why I have given this in NCRT test also You see one more time I have given this year this question guys You see 1034 1034 in Geography Optima test What is Geography Optima test site? Geography Optima test, every year I conduct Optima test which is part of the lecture test where I give top 100 questions of every subject. In Geography, I give top 100, subject, 100 questions of Geography. You see, in Geography 1034 Optima test, I gave this monazite question. I gave this monazite question. Now let me explain you why did I give and why the UPSC also gave this same question. So I asked this question, okay, three months before the UPSC prelims examination. Exactly the same question. Why? Because there was a news that in South India, in South India, okay, uh, there is a ban on this uh, mining of monazite sand, but the illegal mining is going on, guys. You, uh, I think the Madras High Court has put that ban, and in, in southern state, this is banned, but in uh, some of the districts of Tamil Nadu, this was uh, getting illegally mined. Some news was there in the Hindu newspaper. I'll tell you the newspaper also, the Hindu newspaper, it was in the Hindu newspaper, guys. I, I, I vividly remember. 
because I had read that and I put that question in the PPP also, I put that question in the FLT also, I put that question you see in the Optima test also, the 1034 guys, just imagine. See, my, my, what is my way of doing it? See, my way of doing it, I understand what UPSC will ask. I know what UPSC is going to ask, but I know that you will ignore, okay, students will ignore. So what I do is guys, I ask the same question in different, different manner in PPP, Sometimes I will ask in FLT, sometimes I'll ask in Optima test and the reason is I know if you solve three, four times, you will understand why Santosh sir is giving this question and you will pakka, 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 you will read that properly and you're going to solve that question in the UPSC examination guys. So don't you think this is also amazing guys, let us see the next question guys. With your permission, I'd like to go further guys, you see here in the North Hemisphere, the longest day guys, again you see direct question, okay June, I have given the question on this topic see summer solar ties every year this question this topic is in news guys very easy very easy now you see web 3.0 web 3.0 web 3.0 enables control over their own data okay second statement web 3.0 works on blockchain the third statement web 3.0 by users collectively rather than a corporation okay operated by users collectively rather than a corporation guys just you see in just you see some magic you see the magic guys you see web 2.0 is community centric whereas web 3.0 is individual centric you see this directly you see web 2.0 is fiat based web 3.0 is crypto based you see this blockchain based guys you see so you see most of the question most of the question exactly the way of formation is also like that you see web 3.0 is decentralized internet guys same question i gave in did you see the test number guys flt6 just you see flt6 just before the examination because i give seven flt i gave seven flt full length test that year so in flt6 okay the, the second last test i gave this exactly same question you see guys exactly same question i have given see exactly exactly i gave the uh, difference also see centralized decentralized fiat currency cryptocurrency blockchain technology you see guys exactly the same question and you know i gave the card also i gave the card optima card also on web 3.0 and this i shared on the day of exam morning i shared guys i tell you i have posted this question you will see this question in the exam hall i told this same sentence guys because i was very confident i know upsc in and out i know upsc i know the examination paper sector how they frame the question i understand them i don't know them sorry guys don't don't don't, don't take it otherwise i understand the how they work i understand because uh, when i was preparing guys i will tell you i have taken this examination six times i took the prelim six times and i was fortunate enough uh, I cracked this exam six times, okay guys, and I tell you after my first or two attempts, okay guys, I understood how they frame questions and you know that was the only reason I was able to score one of the highest marks in the prelims examination. My average score is more than 125 marks, I have scored till 146 marks in the prelims examination and one, once I scored 139 marks, guys, uh, so I know, I know them, <laughs> I, I understand them, sorry, I understand them how they work. And I can tell you, uh, if you follow my DPN, daily prelims notes, if you follow my prelims power play, and if you solve my all the NCRT test, advanced test, optima test, full length test, guys, no one can stop you from cracking this exam. You see, exactly I have given blockchain technology, decentralized technology, guys. Okay, you see here, community centric, guys. Every exactly this uh, card I had given, exactly this question has come in the exam. Guys, next question you see, sir. SaaS, with reference to software as service, Consider the following statement, SaaS buyers can customize data, SaaS users can access their data through mobile, Outlook, Hotmail, Yahoo Mail, all SaaS. Exactly, word to word, from the daily prelims note, guys, you see here, RBI on payment mandate, RBI on payment mandate, I had given, you see, SaaS as service, SaaS as service, you see, exactly, I have mentioned, Amazon Web Service, Dropbox, Google Apps, Salesforce, guys, you see here, you see here, statement 3, you see here, statement 3 is correct, guys, statement 3 is correct, you see, guys, directly, you see, you see here, SaaS as a service, the advantage behind the method of delivery is that data can be accessed with an internet connection, web browser in any device location, guys, you see here, second, statement 2 is also correct, and statement 1, it helps in, basically, 
customize the data exactly that also is mentioned here guys that also is mentioned here guys you see exactly from the dpn if you read dpn daily prelims notes guys exactly because i know now i know what is the way of asking questions from the science exactly you know this year i have predicted except one question in science and tech guys i have predicted all questions of science and tech if you are one of them who had benefited from following my science optima cards or my dpn or my test series please comment in the comment box i am correct or not okay you can tell if you can tell no sir you are lying you can tell okay no problem but if i am correct if i am honest if i am true please hit the like button guys please hit the like button if i am true okay if i am true you can hit the like button next question you see guys which of the following is a qubits qubits okay in the context qubits okay you see exactly word to word optima cards optima cards optima cards you know uh, we are like on fire this time <laughs> really i get I, I i tell you i got at least 100 calls uh, on the day of exam after the exam and uh, the next day guys more than 100 calls sir thank you thank you for the optima card you see here exactly you see here guys exactly i had mentioned this qubits super uh, you see quantum computers quantum computers qubits guys exactly qubits so answer will be quantum computers answer will be quantum computers guys so if you follow my optima card if you follow my optima notes guys it is very easy guys so question number 36 okay it's an indirect question so i am not considering it contactless payment okay and this uh, okay short range devices i had and i, I had given this but uh, not direct okay so i am not considering this i am not considering this but it was called if you read this detail you can answer this question you can answer this question guys let us now see question number 38 sir guys let us see now question number 38 see probiotics are made of bacteria and yeast the organisms in probiotics are found in food we ingest but they do not naturally occur in our gut probiotics help in digestion of milk guys you just see this you will be amazed you will be amazed you see 14th of february see 14th of february i told you know my favorite day <laughs> guys because i like i love predictions and predictions love me guys okay the rocky bike dialogue okay you see here exactly the same question same topic i had covered here here you see i had given the card also on probiotics because i know upsc will give probiotics this year that is what you can understand my level of understanding i knew this is going to come i had given i had given very limited cards on science and tech at least i think i had given 30 cards out of the 30 cards 10 questions directly came you see it probiotics directly exactly bacteria fungi you see the question guys you see there bacteria yeast exactly you see exactly you see this probiotics bacteria and yeast that naturally stay in the human body exactly guys guys don't you think this is amazing guys dp and 14 the family then go and cross check guys don't you think this is amazing don't you think okay guys if you think yes it is really something amazing guys please hit the like button please hit the like button and if you have missed this okay suppose you missed this you were not in touch of me don't regret guys this year i am going to predict more number of questions i will going to work harder than you okay because see when when i was preparing guys when i was preparing for myself okay i used to prepare okay but when i am preparing for you okay i am preparing for thousands of students of the entire country so i am working harder guys i am working harder because now i am not writing okay if i am writing okay i can ignore myself okay but when i know that there are thousands and thousands of aspirants who are trusting me so it is my responsibility it is my responsibility that i work hard and i predict more and more questions guys i'm telling you i i i don't get sleep in the night guys i'm telling you honestly i'm telling you i don't get sleep in the night because it is a responsibility and i am grateful to lord i am grateful to god that god has really helped me this year and uh, it it helped me to succeed uh, in helping you okay and uh, because when i succeed you succeed okay guys and when you succeed i succeed guys so we we we, we are like a, what to say uh, we are like a partner in this journey of success guys so your success is my responsibility and i tell you honestly i tell you when i was preparing i used to get sleep very easily but when i am helping you when i am preparing for helping you guys i am telling you uh, i don't get sleep because i think now okay i am writing 10000 exams i am writing 10000 exams i don't get sleep really i don't get sleep and i really want to work very hard 
and I really want to continue this. I'm thankful to God, and I hope that God will continue to support me in the future. Also, will give me that uh, what to say, that understanding to understand the exam. And if you follow this, like this next year also, you will be able to get many questions directly in the exam. You guys, you see probiotics anywhere. You see, go anywhere in India. They have predicted this question. Okay, you you know. Okay, yes or no? You can you know the answer. Okay, guys. So just let me know if you had seen this card before the exam. Please hit the like button, guys. Let us see. Go. Let us go to the next question, guys. COVID. Exactly, exactly the same question, guys. You see, PPP, <laughs> February PPP. Go and check. You have. You must be having the PP, PDF, PPP PDF, guys. Guys, there was one fool. Okay, uh, fool. You know what is fool? Okay, stupid person. Okay. He said, "Oh, he is changing the PPP. He is changing the PPP." Okay, just sir, I imagine, I just imagine the kind of negativity they have, the like the level of the negativity they have, guys. Every month after month end, I give the PPP PDF to you. Okay, after every month, you can go and you can cross check. After every month end, I give the PPP. Just imagine, can I change the PPP? Won't you know? Don't know. Will you not catch? Okay, if I change the PPP, please go and change. Check the PPP PDF of February 2022. Exactly the same question. You see, Moderna, which vaccine? Sputnik, which vaccine? Covaxin, which vaccine? Uh, uh, Oxford, AstraZeneca vaccine, which vaccine? You see, exactly the same question has come. You see this exactly PPP prelims power play exactly word to word same question. Sputnik, Sputnik. You see. Guys, exactly. Co-vaccin, co-vaccin. What kind of vaccine? Don't you think this is amazing, guys? At least I tell you, this year, at least uh, I'm saying, I predicted seventy questions, but at least I tell you, at least fifteen to twenty question, word to word, word is also matching, word to word same question, wording is also same. You see. How I am framing the question and how UPSC is framing the question, you can compare, guys. It is in front of you. You can go and down. I see your PDF. You must have downloaded. You must have read the PPP. You can see. If I am lying, you can see. You just imagine how can someone exactly the framing of the sentence is also same, guys. Just you see. Don't you think this is amazing, guys? Don't you think this is amazing, guys? If you really like this, you because see. I was thinking, okay, these vaccines are important. And last year, okay, I was thinking that this question will come last year, guys. And when I did not see this question last year, I was surprised. I was really, literally surprised because I was expecting this question last year. But when UPSC did not ask this question last year, I had a strong, strong belief, guys, that UPSC is going to ask this question. And I deliberately put this question just before one or two months before the exam because if I put it uh, somewhere in September or October last year also this question I had given in the PPP but last year UPSC did not ask but I know <laughs> UPSC is going to ask this is a very important question and UPSC is going to ask this year or next year so I again put in the February PPP and I am fortunate to God and fortunate to UPSC and thankful to UPSC to put this question directly from my PPP. Great guys, you can go and check it. Great, great. Really, God is great. Someone who has read, uh, read uh, said this. God is great. I really say God is great, guys. Let us see next question. Uh, solar flare, guys. Okay. Solar flare. What is the impact of solar flare, guys? Again, direct. Again, direct. September current affairs. Solar flare. Okay, guys. You just see this. You will be amazed. You see the amazed. I put the solar storms exactly, exactly the same car. You see impact of solar storms exactly. And this was the Optima car. If you have seen this Optima car before the exam, please hit the like button, guys. Please comment in the comment box. Yes, you have seen or not. So this was an important question I had predicted, and I am fortunate. I am thankful. I am thankful to the God that this question came in the exam and this video. Okay, I'm making to just to make you understand. See, this is a very important uh, thing because this uh, uh, the solar storms. Okay, they impact uh, the imp the impact the telecommunication networks and the impact that there is an impact on Earth. And I knew that what they will ask impact only. They are not going to ask the science behind that. They are going to ask impact because UPSC, you know, it is a it is not testing your science understanding. Rather than it is testing your awareness. And what kind of impact it can have 
so I have made this thing the impact phase. You see here, okay, telecom networks, power networks can get affected, guys. Next question, okay, guys, this is about the Lakshya test series which I will be conducting. I have made a timetable for the prelims. For people who want to prepare for prelims, I made this timetable. I have included this time 60 plus 10 CSAT test, total 70 test. If you practice this throughout the year, guys, if you practice this throughout the years, guys, I can. I can tell you, your prelims journey will become very easy. If you read the DPN, if you solve the PPP daily, and if you solve this test regularly, see the problem what happens guys, I'm telling you, many aspirants, what they do, throughout the year, they don't practice. I'm telling you, throughout the year, they don't practice. Just before the exam, one week, two weeks, one month, two months before exam, they, they start looking for tests and all, and they, uh, they try to uh, improve their marks. Okay, they try to improve their marks. Okay, but that will not help. Why? Let me just tell you. See, what happens, guys, what happens is when you take tests regularly from the beginning of the year, okay, you get feedback at the beginning of the year. So, you have the time to work on the feedback. You have the time to work on the feedback. Okay, but suppose you take a test at the end of the year. So, even if you get feedback, you don't have the time to improve yourself, guys. Do you think is it logical or not guys? Is it logical or not? So let me just tell you that if you want to really make sure that you want to qualify the problems from the very beginning, take, uh, keep targets. Okay, this week I'm going to cover this and weekend I'm going to take test and then I'm going to analyze it and I'll tell you how to analyze test. I'll make a video on that. Superb, superb video guys, superb and uh, superb strategy I have. And if you follow this strategy guys, your problems mark will shoot like a rocket. It will shoot like a rocket guys. Okay, let us now move forward. Let us see this topic of climate action tracker. Exactly what to what guys you see. December 2021. 6 December 2021. Exactly this topic I had given. Climate action tracker. Just imagine. And why did I ask this topic? Because you see, in, in I was reading one uh, piece, a uh, news article in one magazine. Okay, I, I, I think if I'm remembering correctly, it was down to earth. Okay guys. So I was reading it and there they had mentioned this climate action tracker and I found it really very important and I included this in my DPN that month. Okay, you can check out 6 December 2021. I, do, I don't think anyone in India has covered this, uh, that topic specifically exactly in uh, targeting this EC climate action tracker. I had uh, covered it specifically. I had covered this specifically, and I I, I told also uh, to my students in my optima session that this question is going to come. This is a very easy question. Forty three question with on red lines. Okay, very easy one. I don't think this is very uh, difficult. Here also you see in the DPN I had covered this. I had explained how this red line works. Guys, nice. exactly. I had given this. So this also is very easy question directly from the source. You see WHO. Guideline. This so I had challenged. I said I have posted this question and this question is going to come out on 5th of June guys. I have told this this question. I told my students uh, the WHO norm is going to ask. Okay. I had given this you see in the DPN in the PPP. Okay. Many places you see DPN I had given this entire this has given and I had given this in the you see November current affairs test. November current affairs test. See how I how analytically I frame question. See, this was a news item in September. This was a news item in September. So in the November current affairs test, because it was important, guys, I included in the November current affairs test. Just you see why, how I think, how I am careful to include every important current issues in your current affairs test. Because I know after reading the current affairs for that day. Okay, it is very important for you to revise those important topics in the next month so that you will remember it for the like entire year guys. You can see here, you can see one more question I had asked on this topic guys. You can see here PM 2.0, PM 10, exactly I have given this exactly data also in my explanation of the question guys. Exactly. This was a question, exact question from my test solution and my DPN. You see here, exact. You see the explanation is given. Explanation is given in the explanation. I mentioned this guys. Next, you see Gucci mushroom. Gucci mushroom. It is a fungus. It is grown in Himalayan forest. It is grown in the northeast. So exactly, I I knew this also. I predicted this also going to become and uh, we're going to come in the exam. You see here, guys. You can see here. I made a card on that also. You see, I in the PPP I had given. 
because it is one of the costliest mushrooms in India. You see, Gucci mushroom, India's costliest mushroom found in which state, guys? Just you see, PPP found in which state? I asked this question. It is Jammu and Kashmir. Okay, guys. You see here. You see again. I asked this topic uh, in the DPN. In the DPN. Again, you see this this year also, 2022. You see this 2022 January to 2022. Nowhere in India, I think they have covered in 2022. Nowhere. 2021 they might have covered this because it was a news in 2021. But nowhere in India they have covered this in 2022. You see, I have covered this in 2022 also. You see here, guys, directly. Mushroom belonging to fungi. Mushroom belonging to fungi. Guys, exactly the same question. Let us see the next question. PET. PET. Exactly this question I had predicted from the DPN. I told this plastic is going to come. You see here, exactly. DPN. PET. Recycling. Exactly. Next 47. You see, golden machine. Golden machine. Exactly, exactly, exactly. I predicted in the Optima. I told this topic is going to come. You see here. Blue Fiend Mashir, Optima card. Just imagine, if you have just seen also, you can easily eliminate the answer and you can get the answer, guys. Very easy one, a very easy one, guys. Okay, this was a 48 was an option elimination question, so this was not my from my source. Okay, this was not my from my source. Okay, guys, so we can remove this question. 49, you see, bio rock technology directly from the DPN, bio rock technology directly from the DPN, guys. 49 question also because see coral reefs every year you see one question on wetland one question on coral reefs one question on mangroves is going to come it is going to come i'm telling you honestly last year also there was a question on coral reefs this year also there is a question on coral reefs this year also there is a question on wetlands and mangroves these are some important ecosystem where questions are asked because these are very important for the maintaining of biodiversity okay so every year you see some question around uh, coral reefs some question around uh, wetland some question around uh, uh, mangroves every year it is being asked guys see next miyawaki forest miyawaki method so miyawaki method exactly you see exactly i have given in the test optima test you see in my optima na, which is the most important question predicted question my most important questions every year i'm seeing lots of lots of questions directly coming from my optima test if you have seen that if you have observed that please say yes Please say in the comment box, yes, I have seen that. Okay, if you have observed that, you can say. If you have not observed that, you can say, no, I have not observed it. You can go and check out 1035. Exactly, I have given this Miyawaki forest and I have given a card also on Miyawaki forest. If you have seen this card before the examination, you are a lucky guy. Are you lucky one? Just write, yes, I was lucky one. Yes, I was lucky one. See, I am telling you guys, uh, Miyawaki forest, okay, I, I was uh, predicting this topic, okay, from 2020 onwards. In 2020, I predicted it did not come. In 2021, I also predicted, okay, I, I knew that this is going to come because this is a very important one for the, for the perspective of uh, uh, biodiversity, for the perspective of ecosystem. This is an important one. I had told students even last year also, this question is important, but it did not come last year, but it came, thankfully it came this year. But you see my faith. Can you think, see, many people, they ask me, sir, how was you able to crack this exam year after year see many people they say sir after reading two three years we get discouraged how was you able to do year after year six times you cracked it how see this that is called faith that is called faith you see uh, swamiji has said swamiji means swami vivekanand has said that you should have faith in yourself faith and you can do wonders you can do wonders and even if you have a lot of abilities, but you have doubt inside you, you cannot do anything in your life, guys. Faith is important. You see, how faithfully I carried this topic. It, I, I was thinking it will come in 2020. It did not come in 2020. I again told this topic is going to come in 2021, 2022. That is called faith. I knew this is question is going to come. It is going to come because UPSC cannot ignore this. UPSC cannot ignore this. That is how you have to think. And you, you uh, see, many people, they ask me, guys, that, sir, how can we read two years, three years of current affairs? Guys, you don't read. I am there for what? what? What is my purpose? If you have to do all the hard work, then what is my purpose? Guys, I am here to make your journey easy. You leave it to me. Okay, this was topic two years back, but I included this year. 
Why? Because I know this is going to come. So you don't worry about. Once you are trusting on me, okay, see, trust is a very important uh, thing in life. Okay. Uh, trust comes with a lot of what to say. It's not very easy to gain trust. Okay. So uh, it is one of the, I, I say that uh, uh, everyone cannot afford to have trust. Okay. Once you have trusted me, guys, I it is uh, it is my responsibility that I, I I preserve your trust. And if you see this place, I had preserved your trust or not? Because many of you I see boys and girls calling me and saying, sir, uh, I should read current affairs for one year, two year, like because there are some people who misguide. See, there are many people in uh, India uh, they guide UPSC aspirant, but I tell you uh, honest fact. Most of the people they have themselves struggled in the prelims examination, guys. I'm telling you because I most of, may, many people I know them, many people I know them, and I think I, I can tell you. See, uh, see what happens is that prelims is a very different ball game. Mains it's a very different ball game, yes, sir. I'm telling you, prelims is a very different ball game. And you see, when I tell uh, to student that don't worry, you just read one year current affairs, you forget about the previous years. I will take care. What is important in that, and if UPSC has not asked. UPSC is going to ask in coming years. I know that I will keep it. I will ask them in the test. I am going to ask them. Have I said this or not? How? Any one of you who is watching this video, have I said this or not, guys? Tell me honestly. Honestly, you tell me, have I said this or not? Okay, guys. So even this year, I tell you, don't worry. You just read one year current affairs and let leave rest to me. I will take care of that. Okay. Next, let us see, guys. Let us see. Uh, this was a. Uh, uh, very easy question. This was also covered in the DPM 30 years of Panchayati Raj. This year, you see 1992 2022. I had told Panchayati Raj is going to come in some or the other form, and it came in this form. Really surprised to know. Uh, you see, next year, Gadar Party also I had predicted. Gadar Party also I predicted. See how many questions I had given in Gadar Party. Although this question directly has not come from the test. Okay, but Gadar Party I had predicted. I told many times in you see how many times I have given in the test. You see how many times I have given. So I have given in direct question. How many times I have given in the test Gadar Party? Because I knew Gadar Party. So because there were last year uh, two three developments uh, related to Gadar Party. Uh, Sadar Uddam Singh and uh, one one or two more uh, developments were there. So I thought. Uh, that this is an important uh, topic and they have done a phenomenal contribution they have given for our freedom struggle movement and UPSC will pakka ask this question on Gadar party. I knew that and uh, I am thankful to UPSC and grateful to uh, this institution to ask a question on this topic, really grateful and uh, I hope most of you must have done this correctly guys. Okay, and so let's move, let's move forward guys. Let's move forward. You see Gadar party. I have so many times I gave Gadar party this year. Okay, let us now move. Okay, Crips mission guys. Exactly. Word to word. Exactly. You see 103 T history optima. History optima question. History. See, opt you see how many questions are coming from optima. Optima is what? What is the name of optima? What is the meaning of optima? Most important question. You see exactly. Crips mission. Crips mission this year. Why did I ask? Don't ask me. If everything I, <laughs> why did I ask? Because there was a, this was in news, guys. This was in news. So I had asked. You see how many times I have given Crips mission in the PPP directly from the PPP. It was the first time British offered dominion status. The making of constitution was mainly the Indian hands. Option was available for any province for separate constitution, guys. You see here. Any province which are not prepared to accept the new constitution would have the right to sign a separate agreement with the British. Guys, right, you see exactly, exactly the word PPP directly from the PPP. Guys, don't you think this is amazing? Don't you think this is amazing, guys? You see this 55, question number 55. Appears very difficult. Appears very difficult with reference to Indian history. Consider the following text. With reference to Indian history, consider the following text. Appears very, very difficult. And it is a difficult question. But if you have solved my FLT, in FLT, I had asked a question of Amandana. Okay, you see here in FLT I had asked this question. Okay, in Ajanta paintings, the themes are from Life of Buddha, Jatakas, and Namandanas. So you can just uh, eliminate from here, you can just eliminate from here, remove three, you will get the answer, guys. Okay, don't you think this is amazing? FLT7, FLT7, you can go and cross check. You can go and chop, cross check. Okay, FLT7, question number 78. FLT7, question number 78, guys, you can go and cross check. You must have in the pair. 
PDFs, you can go and cross check. And if you are one of them who are cracking the prelims exam and getting more than 85, and if this has helped you, okay, okay, if this has helped you, please like it and please share this with other aspirants also. See, many aspirants they waste their precious year. See, one year when you uh, don't crack prelims, guys, what do you lose? Just let me, tell you. Just let me explain it to you. One year, if you prepare for the civil services examination and if you fail to crack prelims, you lose just not one year. The amount of time you have spent on your optional subject, the amount of time you have spent on Hindu editorials, the amount of time you prepared on watching TV debates, this, that, whatever mains preparation you have done, it goes waste, guys. So I tell, I tell all students, okay guys, Okay, I not say that you crack the civil services final list in the first attempt. No, I, it will. It is not possible for every one of you to do that. Let me be very frank. Let me not see. There are people who like who just show some dream and just uh, try to cheat you. Okay, they just try to cheat you guys. But I tell you very frankly, you see all the toppers. Okay, see all the toppers. Okay, very fortunate one gets them in the very first attempt. But generally, people try to improve because the competition is so high. But at least if you crack prelims in your first attempt, guys, I can challenge you will pakka get a rank. Pakka get a rank if you crack prelims in the first attempt because you understand the entire scheme of examination. The most of the students, what is happening is that they are not cracking the prelims examination. They are uh, uh, they are not understanding exactly what is this exam pattern because once you crack prelims and once you go inside mains, when you write mains, then only you will understand the entire preparation because the entire preparation starts after the prelims exam only. Optional, mains, many things if you see. Okay guys, so exactly uh, this was, uh, uh, okay, you see, Amandana, text written in Buddhist hybrid Sanskrit language, you see, Amandana, guys, 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 how many of you think this is amazing? How many of you think this is amazing guys? You see the explanation. With this you can have easily, easily solve this question guys. Okay, you see this tight money policy of the US Federal Reserve, capital flight, ECB, okay, ECB, exactly, 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 word to word from the DBM, word to word of the day. US Fed tapering and impact on India. US Fed tapering and impact on India. Exactly, you see the question, 1027. Economy Advanced Test, ECB, External Commercial Borrowings, exactly, exactly the same question. See, in economy, I tell you, last year also I predicted all the questions came from the lecture test, uh, an NCRT, Advanced and Optima. This year also all the economic questions, all, I say all means all, everything came, everything came, you see here, you can see here, everything came, okay, next day you see this, consider the following states, sir. Tea producing one. Okay, you see which of the following states is tea producing in India? <laughs> guys, 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 just I cannot control my laughter. If you can control your laughter, you can tell. If you can control your happiness and laughter, okay, I don't know, but I am not able to control. Why? Because you see, options also same, guys. Options also same. What do you want, guys? Kerala. Okay, in Kerala place, Tamil Nadu or Karnataka, they have mentioned. Guys, Tripura, West Bengal, it is mentioned. Exactly, you see the manner of asking questions. Okay, there is some difference. Okay, I don't say there is no difference. The way UPSC has played this year, na, only one, only two, it was tough to solve. Okay, but you see, if you have solved this question, will you not be able to solve this? Just see, just question yourself. You see, how many times this year, even the options are matching, sir. In the first video, first video which part one, uh, you see that uh, the the Himalayan ranges exactly what to what question was matching. You see the first question Afghanistan border exactly what to what matching. You see this is the third question where options are even matching. Options are even matching, guys. That is the level of understanding of the examination I have. Okay, many people say, sir. Sometimes when you say I have cracked this like that. You seem to be uh, like uh, overconfident. Guys, I'm not overconfident. This is confidence. Okay, when Sachin says that I will go and hit century. Okay, this is not uh, overconfidence. This is confidence and the confidence has come from practice. Guys, and what confidence I have got. Okay, it comes from practice. When I have said uh, my students that, sir, I'm going to, uh, most of the questions will come from the DP and daily prelims notes from the PPP and from the test series okay in the 20 uh, like last year 2011 
uh, I told in I think in September October I promised my students I promised and if uh, if you think I have delivered on the promise please give me a thumbs up if you think I have delivered if you are watching and if you were the part of the program or part of the initiative and if you think I have delivered on the promise okay you can give me a thumbs up and you can write yes sir you delivered on your promise because see what we are what we are we are nothing but what we say and if we stood by what we say if we stand by what we say guys that is what differentiates us okay see see success or not success is not important guys i tell you i really admire mahatma gandhi and mahatma gandhi said okay full effort is full success full effort is full success and i can tell you if you follow my uh, dpn if you follow my ppp if you follow my test you will give full effort and that is your full success I'm honestly telling, and this is telling uh, because once you give full effort, now you will have the satisfaction. Yes, I gave my full effort. I read the right sources. I did the right thing the entire year. Once you do this, guys, that is called full effort is full success. The meaning, meaning, what is the meaning of success? Full effort is the meaning of success. Okay, because what the process is more important, guys. If the process is pure, the result will be also pure, guys. Let us see next question. You see here in the. You see, I had given this in the DPN also. You see, exactly I had given in the DPN. You see, tea producing areas. Why? How I was asking the tea producing area? Why I gave this question also tea producing area? Because this was important this year. Because this year, uh, because of the climate change, because of the climate change, tea production was declining. You can go and cross check in the Hindu, in the business line, in the Financial Express. Because I read three to four papers. You can go and go and check out. Check for yourself, and uh, you know there was one question on T board also, and why it was there in T board question. I'll tell that also, and that also I had covered in the DPN guys. That is the level of expertise you should have. You see this question, Indian Credit Rating, Indian Credit Rating, okay, uh, okay, Indian Credit Rating Agencies are regulated by Reserve Bank of India. Uh, the rating agency is popularly known as ICRA, is a public limited company. Brickworth Rating, Brickworth Rating. You see, magic. I'll show you the magic. Okay. Jadu, you see what Jadu I like to say. You see here, credit rating agencies DPN, credit rating agencies DPN. You see here, you see here, credit rating agency. Okay, you see here, there are six credit rating agencies registered under SEBI. Registered under SEBI. You see, you see the kind of uh, notes which I have given you guys. You see. Registered under Reserve Bank of India. Gone, one gone, one gone, one gone. Answer is two and three. No need to do this. But that also I have mentioned. You see, it appears that UPSC has read this DPN and has framed this question. It appears. Why? Why I say this? It is not arrogance. It is not arrogance, guys. You can see here. Why I say this? You see this question. Big work ratings. Big work ratings. The word also they have picked. Don't you think this is amazing? Hmm. Don't you think this is amazing, guys? You see, it is registered with SEBI. It is registered with SEBI and brickwork rating also I had mentioned. You see, exactly, exactly. You see, guys, brickwork ratings, brickwork ratings registered with SEBI, not RBA. What do you think? What do you think? What is? Please comment in the comment box. You are free to comment. Please comment in the comment box. What do you make out of this? What do you make of the out of this case? What do you make out of this thing? You can do the Google search and you can find out. This was in the DPN. This was there in the guys. Wait one second. Okay, one second. Okay. You see how many times I have given this credit rating agency? Exactly. This means what? This means what? What do you inference you can draw? Here? The inference you can draw is the way I am making the DPN. The way I am making the DPN, the sources which I am referring from D, for DPN, UPSC examination center are also referring that sources. That though you have can easily make out, na? That though I think you can easily make out. My sources, my way of approaching this examination is same as the people they are framing the questions. They also have the same way of thinking about it, guys. That is the one thing you should appreciate. This. See, good things in life if you do not appreciate. Okay, what will happen? Good things will die. Okay, if good things are not supported, good things are not appreciated. See, as a human being, as a human being, we have the duty to appreciate good. Okay, because we when we see something, okay, a good movie, a good acting, 
okay a good uh, uh, a good uh, uh, cricketing shot played by either sachin or sehwa okay we have we clap we clap or not guys so don't you think you need i need a clap here okay guys if you think i need a clap please please do in 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 the comment box i I'll, i'll go I'll, i'll i'll see all the comment okay what you are trying to say i'll see all the comment guys okay so let us see this okay guys let us see further okay let us see further if i go like okay you see credit i have made a card also on that oh baba <laughs> you see optima card also i have made one optima card most important topic uh, i i forgot you just see how many questions i predicted i even forgetting because so many questions 70 plus questions guys you see optima card credit rating agencies registered with sebi brick work rating <laughs> Can you see this, guys? Guys, can you see this? Okay. If you think you can see this and you think it is amazing, please hit the like button, guys. Okay. Okay. Let us uh, let us see. Uh, let, let us go further. Let us go further, guys. Okay. You see, sixty-four BBP. Very easy question. Bank board bureau. I think it's a very easy question. That also is covered in the DPM. Bank board bureau. Exactly word to word question. Bank board bureau. September twenty twenty one. September twenty twenty one guys exactly what what to what guys sorry convertible bonds because this was important UPSC was I was expecting this question to come it's an important institution bank board bureau is an important institution on economy uh, appointments of uh, the heads of the public sector banks see public sector banks are in news because they are trying to reform the public sector bank. and reform of public sector bank is very important for the economy we cannot achieve the 4 trillion 5 trillion economy without public sector banks they are the backbones of the entire economy guys and the npa problem which they are facing okay it it it, it is very important that the governance has to be improved and in the in the dhanush program okay appointment of these people okay the heads of the banks is very important guys i hope i making sense okay guys let us see next uh, convertible bonds exactly from the dpn exactly from the dpn and the full length test also you see convertible bonds was asked convertible bonds was asked explain everything exactly from the full length test 5 full length test 5 and in the dpn also i had given this convertible and non convertible bonds guys exactly word to word this you see one more thing and uh, this blog i am going to post uh, okay in the comment box you can read this blog and you can get to know exactly about these details where from where question came and how i was able to do it okay and uh, i will help you learn this also because i told you na i want you to uh, i want to teach you learn to fish because once you follow this for an entire one year and practice the test okay i'm telling you nowhere in india okay they will teach you option elimination okay through test through ppp if you take my test if you take my test guys every test i am including option elimination if you have solved last year test uh, and if you have seen that please tell in the comment box yes you have seen that okay please tell please please tell okay because once in a once we start practicing it in the tests then in the real exam also we will be able to do that guys but suddenly what people do okay just they learn some trick and they apply in the exam or sometimes they are not able to apply guys okay let us next see see uh, consider the following uh, bodies asia infrastructure investment bank missile technology control regime shanghai cooperation you see exactly i have given this in the ppt missile technology control regime asia infrastructure bond very august 2021 march 2022 august 2021 march 2022 ppt prelims power play okay you can see this guys in front of you in front of you can go and download march 2022 You, you, I, I think you already have downloaded. You can go and cross check. And August twenty twenty one, go and cross check, guys. Go and cross check. Shanghai Cooperation Organization also I have given. Next is a very easy question sixty eight. Uh, uh, very easy one. It was a sector. Uh, here also I have mentioned RBI and inflation. RBI is the responsible for managing amount of inflation, guys. Okay, let us see now. Okay, let us see here. Okay, because this is following statement, sir. Okay, all this thing. Okay, no, no, very easy ones. Okay, so many times it was covered. Okay, now you see NFT, NFT, non fungible tokens, NFT, non fungible tokens, guys, non fungible tokens. Exactly word to word, this question is there for the test. Exactly word to word, exactly word to word, this question is taken from the FLT, FLT six, FLT six. You see here, read. Let us read. Okay, because see, I was very confident. 
that non fungible tokens are going to come this year very very confident i gave the optima cards i gave this in the test i also gave in the prelims power play question also i have given this okay you see here okay you see here okay they can be traded or exchanged okay i have given this exactly this statement they are mutually interchangeable with crypto something like that exactly the word i had mentioned this exactly the word i have mentioned this let me just uh, show you uh, exactly how it is different from cryptocurrencies how it is different from cryptocurrencies exactly i have non fungible tokens are not mutually interchangeable guys exactly this word i had mentioned exactly you see this question okay and you, if you have solved this question you can this was a sector if you have solved you see 71 and 60 and you see <laughs> don't you think this is amazing guys you see 71 flt 6 69 the final test guys even the numbers are matching what do you want is guys numbers are matching you see 69 71 okay just kidding kidding don't take it seriously this was a joke okay don't take it seriously guys but you see exactly this question exactly this question matching okay guys let us now further go further okay okay you see non fungible tokens exactly i had given you see again in flt7 also just think, oh my god just you can imagine can you imagine this you see you see there is flt6 i gave non fungible tokens again 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 in flt7 also guys i am giving you non fungible tokens you and cross check flt6 flt7 both test i gave non fungible tokens you see exactly in both the test just just see my level of understanding i am repeating those questions because i know this question is going see many people others what they will do they will try to ask different different questions just to touch many questions but i am i am the fool i am a fool many people will think i am a fool because i am thinking for you yourself no? i am thinking for you i am thinking for students i am giving the same question multiple times because i know this is going to come and i know you to i want you to practice it i don't want you to ignore this and i know this is going to come that is a faith i have in myself the faith i have in my material the faith i have in my test and the faith i have in my students who are following my material diligently diligently that is a faith and that faith if you develop guys no one can stop you from cracking the prelims examination no one can stop you see exactly exactly guys exactly okay so uh, uh, you see next question you see this question also question number 70 question number 70 you see directly in no, no, no direct sorry sorry my uh, please forgive me not direct indirect question you see mython dam mython dam i had asked uh, this question you see you see exactly question number 16 hydel power projects and the rivers hydel power projects in the region gandhi sagar gandhi sagar you see guys because i this time i told many students these dams reservoirs are going to come you see gandhi sagar i had i had guessed that i had told if you have attended my geography optical sessions i had told you this uh, uh, reservoirs are going to come you see you see this you can only see this gandhi sagar and you see again question number 4 the mother valley of mython dam mython dam mython dam it is in jharkhand bengal border jharkhand guys so you see you, i i don't think anywhere in india you will get mython dam in any study material i don't know if this year any study material you have read and if you have found this mython dam let me know Please, you can type in the comment box. Yes, I have seen this material or that material. You can tell me. I don't think anywhere in India you must have seen this. Okay, because in this topic, if you see, okay, Mython Dam was the toughest one. Mython Dam was the toughest one. Many people don't know why, where Mython Dam. If you know, if you knew more Mython Dam, only you can know if you are from Jharkhand and Bihar. Otherwise, you cannot know where is this Mython Dam. Gandhi Sagar very easy. Indra Sagar very easy. But to know Mython Dam, it was very difficult. And if you have read my material, if you have read my material, guys, you will understand Mython Dam. Guys, don't you think this is amazing? Don't you think this will help you if you had read this, if you have solved this? Obviously, guys, obviously, guys, it's going to help you. Okay. Labor Bureau, very easy. Uh, I will not say, you know, so you see, Labor Bureau also I had covered in the DPA. Guys, fifth schedule, you see, FLT. Again, FLT test to fifth schedule because uh, tribal issues are in news, and uh, fifth schedule and sixth schedule are always important for the UPSC prelims examination. So, 
uh, alternate years they ask 10th schedule, 5th schedule, 6th schedule every year. Either they will ask 10th schedule or they will ask 5th schedule or they will ask 5th schedule. You can go, you can cross check the last 10 years paper. Okay, you see I have given this question on 5th schedule. Exactly, 5th schedule. Then you see advanced part 2 also I have given this question on 5th schedule. Okay, next you see which of the following states are 5th schedule. Okay, you see here. Which of the following states are 5th schedule? 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, Rajasthan, Jharkhand, okay, which schedules are having 5th schedule? Exactly this question 5th schedule I have asked. Okay. Uh, you see 74 also, okay, it is indirect from DPN. National Institute of Urban Affairs I had covered. National Institute of Urban Affairs I had covered. You see here, Urban Governance. This I had covered in one editorial. It came in one editorial, Hindu editorial. I had covered, you see, National Institute of Urban Affairs. Exactly, I had covered this. So, if you had read this, you could have solved this in the DPN, guys. In the DPN, okay. This question, guys, amazing. 75 question. I would say that this was really amazing. Really, 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 this is amazing. 75 because this year, okay, I'll tell you, explain you why did I ask this question and why UPSC has also asked this question. See, this year, World Water Day. This year's World Water Day is basically on groundwater. The theme was groundwater. And I was thinking, if they ask question on groundwater, what will they ask? I kept on thinking, 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 thinking. I framed two questions in the FLT. Okay, you can go and cross check the FLT, FLT 7 and FLT 6. I gave two questions on groundwater. You see, let me show you the question which I framed. You see this question. Central Groundwater Authority is a body under Environment Protection Act. Central Groundwater Commission is under National, uh, uh, sorry, wa sorry, World uh, Water uh, Prevention, uh, Pollution Prevention Act, 1974. Exactly, Mihisha Committee recommended their unification. You see, because I knew if they are going to ask question on this uh, uh, wa uh, groundwater, they will ask on the institution because. Uh, just last year they have asked question on the geographical aspect of groundwater. So I thought, okay, they are not going to ask question on the geographical aspect rather than they are going to ask question on the institutional aspect. And I included this in the FLT. I'll tell you exactly which FLT. You see FLT 6, 1047 test. You go and check FLT 6, 1047 test. Exactly this question I included. Exactly this question. Question number, okay, question number uh, 10. 47, test number 1047 and 26, you see. And I am explaining the reason. See, the reason is also very important because geographical aspect they have already asked, so they will ask institutional aspect. You see, the kind of thinking <laughs> it goes in the exam hall, uh, sorry, in, in, in the test preparation. And you should also think inside the exam hall like this. Next, you see, uh, credentials committee directly from the DPN, credentials, UN credential committee directly from the DPN, you see, UN credential committee directly from the DPN, 29th May 2021, May 2021, that's why I say, I say, I have told my students in lecture, April 2021 to April 2022, this was the target or not, you tell me honestly, I gave you this target or not, my Optima notes were from April to April or not, you see, May 2021, <laughs> what do you have to say? Anywhere in India you found this credentials committee. If you have found, please comment in the comment box, guys. You are free to comment. You are free to comment, guys. So thank you. Uh, thank you. Next, I will make another video on the rest 20 questions. Thank you, friends. Bye-bye. Take care.